Okay, people, so we're back. So let's dig into this motherboard. Oh, before we start, remember, give me a thumbs up, give me a like, give me a dislike, give me a something. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. I'm always coming back with different variety of content. I don't stick to one thing. I know some people wanna see all about video cards. We have crushed video cards, but we are gonna be doing some stuff on the new video cards coming out, which are the TI versions of the 3070, 3080. The difference is more CUDA cores and they up the RAM. How much it's gonna help, I don't know. Tell you the truth, I don't even know why they're doing it. I'm confused. This, this whole market is like blowing my mind totally. Okay, <laughs> all right. So, I know you can all see this. I don't think it's, no, it's not taped. Now, this is a virgin opening. Opening. I haven't opened this yet, so we don't know what we even have in here. So, come along with me. I imagine, yes, this is just going to be cables, probably antenna. As I said, cables antenna looks like it's all antenna it's heavy must be magnetic we're not going to get into stats on this board other than the size of it is pretty much spot on with the regular atx i was thinking about getting a eatx but wow they're big and that torrent case looks sweet, baby. Oh, that thing looks sweet. What we got under here? What we got under here hiding? Oh, wow. Okay. What the devil is this little gizmo? Somebody's probably sitting there right now. Okay. First off, yes, we have another... Lamborghini sticker. Um, yeah, Lamborghini. And we have, I guess these are weights for the tie downs. And wow, they give you some little tools. There's a little Phillips head and a little standard. Um, we come with some fancy, fancy schmancy decals. I, I like decals. I got them all over my car. No, just kidding. Um, I don't know who uses it. These are like a vinyl. This is cool. What a, what a odd, different material. Very, feels like a vinyl cover to it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Cut that out, John. We have the um, MSI gaming logo in a few different varieties. We have the mag logo we have some little racing stripes on it i don't know it's got some different things on the logo so anyways yeah all right um okay wow that's that's really a nice touch it comes with some some uh some some cable uh yeah some cable and sadder let me see fan identifiers a little stick on papers uh, yeah, we've got one that says other, so it says mag, you can probably just, they want you to stick it wherever, stick it on you, never mind. Um, we have some for the SATA, we have display, we have fans, and we have RGB. Wow, they really dug in on this, pretty big book for, what's this, oh, some advertisement stuff, enough of that, and a looks like a very thick book a booklet a manual manny manual okay here's this like um rgb cable more rgb cable and there's a few sad as one has a 90 on one end and it's straight and the other is just two straight ends okay so Enough. I'm curious. What is this? Let, let me 
grab me glasses. What I do with the things? I'm blind as a bat without the bloody things. I don't know. I'm losing them things all the time. Okay. Oh, okay. It is a brush. A brush. All right. I, I guess. Oh, well, okay. I mean, I get it. It's kind of like a little throw throw in, you know. Uh, I don't know when's the last time I had to do that. I just have a little portable air compressor and uh, thing fills up and bingo, done. All right, so let's open this bad boy up. thing is heavy oh my word why I don't know if you've noticed this but I'm gonna say it it seems the Intel boards no matter what company whether it's Asus uh, MSI gigabyte I don't care what company it is no matter what they make it it seems to be a nicer looking board I mean, I like my AMD stuff, but we're going to see how the Intel goes, but wow, very nice, very nice. Okay, so these new boards come with DDR5 memory, okay, it has dual opening on four slots for the, for the uh, memory sticks. 1700 LGA 1700 we have PCIe 5.0 again we haven't even maxed out 3.0 but hey Intel it, it, this is what gets me Intel usually goes about two years before they change so within two years they're gonna go over to their next version of the board so, uh, um, we will probably still won't even be fully utilizing 4.0 by the end of that time. So three PCIe's, probably a 16, an 8, and an 8, or even a 16, 16, 8. I'm not sure. I didn't get into it. M.2, M.2, and I would almost be betting there could very well be an M.2 under here. We have an 18 and 1 plus 1. VRAM. Sweet. We have our chokes. Over here you have your compa your capacitors, chokes, and then back is where your VRAM is. They have a nice, nice heavy metal. Actually, the top of it feels like it's plastic. The cover. Okay. This is all metal, all metal. Anyways, um, all heat sink, heat sink, heat sink. Looks like we have an, at least an eight layer board right here. We also have the two eight pin connectors. I'm not sure how that works with Intel. You'll probably only need one unless you're going to be doing serious overclocking. We have a 24 pin power connector. We have a ton, a ton of fan connectors. There's plenty of fan connectors. Um, most AIOs, standard AIOs, I'm going to say most, don't mind my Discord, I apologize for that, do fit on the 1700. They, 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 I, I can assure you that all the companies are going to come out with an exact um, setup, patent, that's going to be made for the LGA 1700. But as it is right now, I would probably say 90% or better of the AIOs, they have the tabs on the, on the back where you can adjust them. Um, 
will slide in and will fit. Okay, we have six SATAs. We have a USB-C suite. There is also a little BIOS indicator light to tell you if everything's good with the board or read the code and if, if, if it's given a code and there's something wrong with it, you can look that up. Well, this is a really nice looking board. I like it. I love the black PCB. I'm very surprised they didn't put a back cover on this. For the, This is like a $400 board, man. Anyways, typical Intel metal back plate. That may have to come off with depending on what AIO you use with it. Uh, if you're going with your standard um, cooler that comes with the CPU, you're golden. It just pops right on. Um, very nice. Very nice. I am not Steve from Gamers Nexus, so I don't get into the microscopic details, but just wanted to give everyone a look at this. This is what's going in that system. I'm dying to build in that case. Look, another system fan up over here. Wow, this thing's got fan, 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 fan. RGB, RGB, ARGB. Well, I can tell you what. You're not going to have no problem finding a spot to put your fans. All right. So here we are again. I have a carbon Wi Fi in my AMD board, but it's not a mag, I don't think. I thought it was an MPG. Anyways, I think, yeah, it is a Mac. Um, anyways, so here we are. Wrapping up another video after taking a short, brief review, overview. Call it what you will. Same shit, different smell. Excuse my French. I don't know what the big deal is, but it is what it is. Wow, this is... <laughs> there might be room under here for two. I think there is. You might be able to put two under here. I am almost tempted. Okay, curiosity killed the cat. Satisfaction, brought it back. Come on, bear with me people. We're just gonna take a quick peek. I think this, there might be two under here. Sure as Skittles, two M.2s, wowsy wow. I'm wondering if they did it here. There may be room for four on here. Okay, yeah, you ain't putting nothing on the back. There ain't no need for it. Wow, that, that is so different. That's, that's very nice, very nice. Big selling point. Over here, there is a switch. Again, I don't have my glasses on. It looks like an LED. You may be, it may be to turn off all your LEDs on the board. There might be a bio switch. I'm surprised there isn't buttons on here. Where are they? No buttons to press to start it? No, not this time. All right. Let's wrap this up. Stick around in the future. Bear with me. We're going to sit around. We're going to watch. We're going to build this bad boy, and we're going to clock it out. You know something? I'm going to get the, I'm going to get the fastest one that they have. I am going to get the 12900K. That's what I'm going to put in here. If we're going to do benchmarks, and we're going to put it up against my 5950. In single core processing, this will probably beat it. And multi-core, multi-threading, I don't think so. But we'll see when we get there. All right, everybody. Have a great day. Have a great rest of your week. By the time you see this, your week. 
and um, stay safe. And don't forget, again, subscribe if you're new to this channel. Give me a thumbs up. Give me a like. Show me some love. All right, people, seriously, we're done here. We'll be back with another one for you very soon. Thank you. Have a good day.